and made a scale out of them just by splicing them together in an audio program. That's up an octave, right? Normally on a, no, on, on, a, on a piano like this, on a keyboard, these would be a few keys apart. But the point is that the natural logarithms are irrational numbers. So very few of these intervals are actually fall anywhere on the regular keyboard. Like these notes aren't any of the, of the pitches that are created by the circle of fifths starting at C. They're all different pitches except for this one, which is G. Normally G is here on the keyboard. Here's C. Normally G is here, right? But instead that same pitch is on this key. That range between C and G, which on the normal keyboard takes up almost the entire octave, is divided into a few notes that are kind of far apart from each other. Right? But as you go higher in the scale, they get closer together. So up here, C and the note right below it are very close together. These two notes are close together. You know, they're, they're cl you hear how they're real close together? Not, but they get farther apart as we go down. And here we so the point is that they get closer together as you go up. It's kind of a weird scale. These weird chords, like... They're, you know, they're chords, but my question was, are they, can you make music like that? And here's this one, I played you this earlier. Those notes are all close together. I'm trying to work out the theory of the scale and the, the notes and chords and how they fit together, you know, because there's certain patterns and ways that you move around on a keyboard or on a guitar on any in instrument that are. Well, they're, they're patterns, you know, they're, they're visual patterns, you look at them, you have a feel for them, they're, you hear them, and I'm trying to work out what those patterns are, you know, like Wild Thing, that's a very strong pattern, that's a strong pattern on the guitar, and also it's a pattern that you write almost every pop song around, somewhere, those, somewhere that little box of chords ends up in there on guitar. I'm trying to find that, what's the Wild Thing in the new scale.